welcome to the Colt Moo Pepper Show. On today's episode, we have Sticky Fingers Bakery's All Natural Red Pepper Jelly. This pepper jelly contains both red peppers and a little bit of habanero chilies. We do not know the Scoville heat of this product, but we will soon find out. So we're doing a couple of pepper jellies. Uh, the last one we did was that roasted, what was it? Like a chipotle? Yeah, it was a chipotle jelly. Like um, this one, just normal red pepper. Would not expect that to be too hot, but it does have a little bit of habanero in it, so that's good. That's the one thing that my pepper jellies are missing is habaneros. <laughs> that's true. Habanero, I think, would make a good pepper jelly. Yeah, it would. It's, it's so got citrusy great and fruity. Ooh, that smells kind of good. Mm, it's got some tartness to it. Just dive right in there. Oh, it's very, uh... <laughs> I was expecting it to be more gelatinous than it's what More it solid? <laughs> it's kind of goopy. Yeah, that's good. It's more like, like a preserve. Mm-hmm. A jelly. Oh, that's good for a drink of destiny. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Wow, that's got really good flavor. Yeah, it's it's really sweet up in front, but it get, it has a nice kick in back. And kind of nice vinegar along with it too. Yeah, that tartness really helps it out. Ooh, yeah, that actually that's got some pretty decent heat there at the back end. Yeah, pretty decent. I mean, definitely not something you're just there to you know take spoonfuls of exactly. No. But you know, in all uh, purposes of pepper jelly, that one is really tasty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a lot better than that first one that we had. Oh yeah, I, I think it beats both of them. I enjoyed it, so. Definitely beats both of them. So yeah. uh, I guess we better try this on some toast. See how it really goes down. Cheers. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah, definitely good like that. Man, that would make a great pepper, or a jelly and a Peanut butter sandwich. Yeah. Yeah, it would. Or use a little bit of uh, cream cheese. There you go. Mm. That would be really good. Mm. They recommend trying it on soft cheese and crab cakes. Hmm. Crab cakes might be interesting. Yeah, I would never have thought I'd try it on that. Mm -mm. Mm. When you eat it, man, it starts kicking hot. Yeah, that has got some nice burn. Okay. Yeah. Surprise. <laughs> mm. See, that's how I think most jellies should be, or you know, if they, just anything that says that it's hot mm -hmm. should have that kind of habanero burn to it versus just the jalapeno. Mm -hmm. To me, the jalapeno is more of a flavor than it is a spice. I wonder what that'd be like. That the, the shrimp cocktail, cream Ooh. cheese thing. Put a little bit of dab on that. Oh yeah, yeah. Interesting. Sticky fingers. Good job, guys. Uh, this has been the Cold Boom Pepper Show. Thank you for joining us.